Right guys, well, I'll just show you what I'm up to. As you can see, when they did the door, they put us a bit of substantial cement around the bottom part to stop weather getting in, but unfortunately, some of it's obviously corroded and cracked while they were moving the panel. And also, it's so bad, you can see gaps in the bottom there, uh, in terms of what they've done. So I'm gonna put a, basically a, a big bead of cement going around um, to seal up because I am getting water penetration in the bottom of here um, Not sure how it's happening, but it is happening nevertheless So, you know when they build a garage what they tend to do is put a bit of cement like this at the bottom all the way around the bottom now they have done like a, an, a, a, a Poor attempt at doing so when they built the garage in the first place um, obviously I've pulled a lot of this out, but this is the original that they've put and there's maybe I don't know a centimetre worth of coverage of cement going around which isn't good enough um, If if that might be even half that um, So I'm gonna put a new amount of cement around here just to prevent uh, Weather getting in and hopefully that'll do the job uh, But I just wanted to show you a closer look really I know it's a bit dark, but um, I don't know if you can tell here There's like a, a gap. I don't know if you can see that in the video But there's a gap where you can actually see light coming through down there Which means obviously that's an obvious place for uh, water to get in. I thought I'd show you the outside as well As you can see it's not completely flush with the concrete base um, and in the corners in particular that's certainly a place where water can get in. So that's why I'm having to put um, a bit of a border of cement round uh, just to try and prevent the weather getting in if I can. So I thought I'd just show you that. Um, so it's really important that you make sure you do some, have a decent amount of border protection on the inside to prevent rain getting in through the bottom of the slabs unfortunately they're not completely flat they will be um, micro cracks where water can get in and trust me water will get in no matter what so if you want to seal it up properly do a good job around the door that's where your weak points are so if we go over here as you can see we've got obviously gaps in the bottom here and I have cemented a lot on the inside to try and prevent that getting through so I thought I'd just show you that on the outside